Hey guys, this is Brink Ripple once again for Pay to Play Studios, and uh, today I'm going to be talking to you guys about Black Ops 1, my thoughts on it. Even though it's an old game, I really enjoy it. So first of all, I want to talk about Black Ops 1. They were the fir That was the first game that we uh, implemented the currency system, and I believe the only game we implemented the currency system. Uh, I, th I believe what it was was every 10 XP you get $1, or 1 point in-game and you use those points to buy guns after you unlock them. I thought that was a revolutionary idea and I was hoping they would have that in Black Ops 2 as well as Modern Warfare 3. That way that you know you don't have to get all these other guns you can just hey let me save up and use this shit gun to uh, to get the we'll say DSR. You know I was hoping that would be how it is but unfortunately it isn't but other than that Black Ops 1 was a great game the, one of the most fun games I've ever played. Uh, noob tubes were not overpowered. Quick scoping was not a big issue. Um, trick shots were rare, and when they were actually seen, it was incredible to watch. So that was a plus. Um, there wasn't much of a competitive side to it, but the game itself was competitive, which I thought was really cool. Uh, lag comp, there wasn't that much lag from what I remember. Like I'm sure there was a lot of lag, but I mean... Compared to other games, <coughs> Modern Warfare 3, <coughs> it really wasn't that bad. And uh, right now, Black Ops 2 isn't doing so hot with their lag comp either, in my opinion, of course. But that's just because I have crappy internet. But yeah, so those are my thoughts on Black Ops 1. See you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. This has been Brink Ripple or Nick, and uh, I'm out. Peace.